Bowmanville Zoological Park has a long and storied history that dates back to 1919 when it was known as the Cream of Barley Park, a recreational attraction that was home to a small petting zoo. In 1964, the park became the Bowmanville Zoo and in 1988, under new ownership, became known as Bowmanville Zoological Park. It's a unique year for Bowmanville Zoo. It's our 90th anniversary. Uh, in fact, we are the oldest private zoo in North America. In addition to this, we're a member of the Canadian Association of Zoos and Aquarium, the World Association of Zoos and Aquarium, and the Zoological Association of the United States. We're very proud of these, uh, of these memberships because it underlines the professionalism and high quality of animal care that we provide at our facility. 90 years and looking forward to the future. You too, eh, girl? I've been involved with Bowmanville Zoo for the past 20 years. And in that time, we've taken the zoo from an attendance figure of around 27, 30,000. Today, we're well over 100,000. Uh, we're very proud of this. Uh, we are an integral part of the community. So everything from uh, Terry Fox runs to hospital fundraisers, we're there. Beyond the zoo operation, we've greatly expanded our work in animal off-site work. And this can range from everything from uh, camel rides at the Toronto Zoo to elephant rides in Park Safari in Quebec. Uh, we have the largest uh, stable of trained film animals in the world and um, have been responsible for specific productions coming to southern Ontario. The programming jewel at the crown of Bowmanville Zoo is the Anima Theatre Show. Uh, on site we have the world's, one of two uh, in the world, uh, animal specific uh, performance venues. Everything from rubber floor to special holdings, they're all there to ensure that the, the shows that we can put on for our guests are of the highest quality. So now he's got two for two, that's great. How many people think this is the smartest course ever? Bowmanville Zoo is going to build on its 90 years of existence. And now we're looking to take it to the next level, which will be a, have it as an emerging adventure park uh, on a regional and, uh, and, and quasi-national level. It's a five-year plan. It involves everything from canopy tours to expanding our elephant herd. Um, it's exciting. We've, uh, we've embarked on it with the addition of Expedition Predator, which is a tram ride through uh, predator enclosures. And you may see a lion, a tiger, a wolf, a black jaguar. It all depends what's, uh, what's out there that day. Um, and again, it keeps the excitement going, and it's about up close and personal at Bowmanville Zoo.